Hey man, what's going on? I just had to drop this video on y'all, man. You feel me? Fresh out the shower with it. Let me go on here. Y'all been seeing that um damn that Kate that that that, that um Renton House Kyle case. Y'all see what's going on? Y'all see how they using that case? Got people, you know, in the uproar. They got fights going on, all kind of racial shit going on. And at the end of the day, I just did a video earlier today talking about the same shit. At the end of the day, all that energy being transferred from one spot to the next. Because energy don't go nowhere. All it does is transfer. All that energy being transferred. Oh, fuck you. Oh, this. Go back to out. Oh, this. Bro, where does it stem from? The puppet master. Like I say, who controls the spell? And people be like, oh, spells ain't real and this and that. <laughs> you got to sit back and look. You have to open your eyes. Okay? Who controls that spell? Okay? Who's the, who's the puppet master? Who sot this whole shit up? And when you think about it, it ain't me. It ain't you. Because none of them... Have shit to do with the justice system. They didn't create a motherfucking thing. One, one won't trump. You get what I'm saying? One saying this and one saying that. All this shit stemming from a motherfucking case that they knew was going to happen. But they are the ones that put this, <clears throat> this hate in your blood, in your heart. They the ones who do it. Man, they got fights going on. People getting arrested. Now, now look at this. The motherfucker that broke into the Capitol on Capitol Hill, whatever it was, that when they broke into the Capitol, the motherfucker went in that bitch taking selfies, propping their feet up on them people's shit. All kind of shit. The bitch broke into, they broke into the Capitol. Capitol Hill. Y'all know motherfucking well there were black folks, my nigga. You already know this shit would have ended differently. But this is, a, this is by design. I told y'all, they have to continue to do these things. They had to have the motherfucker going to that Capitol, State, um, Capitol building. Look at the outcome. Ain't nobody saying shit. They showing you in plain sight like, nigga, you don't run nothing. This is what goes on in America. And while we over here going, worrying about what's going on in America, worrying about this and worrying about that and worrying about this, bro, it's all kind of shit going on in other countries that's going to be on its way over here. Y'all better look at what's going on in Australia. You feel me? Bro, I'm going to tell you something. At the end of the day, you know what I'm saying? We are living in a, in, in a world where you at war for your fucking mind. I told y'all, I did a video the other day. Attention. Who has your attention? And he who governs your attention governs your reactions. And your reactions or your actions... It's going to determine where you is and where you ain't in life. What do you see and what you don't see in life? At the end of the day, we don't control none of this shit. Do you understand, comprehend what I'm saying? Everything in your life, you do not control it. You don't control how you, how you consume water. Don't you know it's illegal to catch a rainwater? Capture rainwater is illegal. You can't even consume water, some free, some that God, some God put on earth for all us to have. But you've been brainwashed thinking you got to go to the store to buy water. You never went to a spring. A lot of y'all scared to drink straight out the water, straight out the ground on, on, from a spring. Because you was conditioned not to. Do you know how critical that is to, to hold another man accountable to how you see the world? Do you, do you comprehend what that means? So when you speak shit out your mouth, how, are you speaking it because of your experiences or because of what another bitch told you? I could take you to a spring right now in Florida, in Ocala, Florida. I took my kids there. I'm talking about 98% pure water. You can see to the bottom of that bitch. And I guarantee you a bitch will be scared to drink that water. But a drink out of a a plastic a plastic bottle that has all kind of chemical chemicals. But this is because you are conditioned that way. You get what I'm saying? 
If you look at a woman on TV and you see a woman on TV and you say, oh, she in the jungle, she on the ground, she playing around in the dirt and doing this. Do you know half the women will have a fit just looking at that? Seeing, a, seeing her, now I ain't going to say all, but majority of y'all, majority of women will be like, hell no, I ain't getting my nails dirty, I ain't getting my feet dirty. Why? Because we've been conditioned to think that shit. When you stop, right, when you stop and you pause your life and you just think, man, just think for one second. Just think. Stop letting them think for you. When you sit and you think and you look at the shit that you doing and ain't doing, why? Because of what another bitch told you. I told, I, <laughs> See, my videos, I break them down so you can easily understand them. When I talk about hoarding or hurting, I keep saying hoarding, hurting when you're in a herd, okay? They understand how the human brain works. You don't. They know that you're going to go with the majority of people. And 99% of the shit we do in life, we do it because other people do it. And you might say, no, we don't. See, that's the fucking trick. Okay? That's the fucking trick. Because you do. You haven't experienced nothing for yourself and, and, and said what it was. You was told what it was. I told you, man, when you born, they give you a religion. They give you a name. They give you a social security number. They give you a, a cult, or they not, or they give you a, 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 a you black, you white, you Hispanic, you this, bro. What the fuck? All these barriers. That's why they say a child's mind is, is is at its purest because they haven't been told all these fears. You might see a baby sitting around a snake, and that snake can go all around him and won't touch him. And you be like, this baby crazy motherfucker. It's not that the baby is crazy. The baby hasn't had those fucked up programs downloaded in their mind for fear. Fear. I'm going to do a whole nother video on fear. And it's going to blow your mind how they weaponize fear. How they weaponize miseducation. Anyway, if you look at this shit that's going on in this case... Not only that, they let that dude, Kyle, pick his own jurors. And see, the picture that they use, like I told y'all, when they want to put something out there on the news, they use the right picture to express the right feeling that they want to. That's that spell. He digging his hand in that bit like he digging his hand in a fucking candy, um, a fucking um, candy jar. Picking them letters or picking them names. So-called picking them names. I ain't no damn motherfucker pick their own jury. But all I'm saying is this, man. Stop putting your faith in these fake-ass politicians. Stop putting your faith in all these people. How about, oh, they gonna do this and they gonna do that. Once you vote them in, it's the hell with you. Stop putting your faith in a government or... This whole political game like it's going to change your life. It is not. Please wake up, people. And this is why I get so mad when a certain group of people, just because they're a certain color, think that they're better than others. When we all got one coming enemy, man. Come on, bro. We got one coming enemy, man. The same people that's finna fucking shit on me, they finna shit on you. And when you holler, oh, you religious, oh, God, this God. You know what God gonna say? I gave you common sense. Why are you looking at me? Get up off your knees. Stop praying. Look at the word pray. You are, you are praying. And most folks don't even know how to pray. You don't ask for nothing. You see it through. You see it already done. It ain't I wish. I hope. Please. It's I see that. It's already done. I claimed it. Now that I see it in my mind. Because I told you your mind. Your body is an instrument of your mind. If your mind say you, you can't do something. Your body going to follow suit to what your mind said. So when you set your mind to say. Oh, I already got it. I just got to get it. Now you just told billions of cells in your body, we got this. 
and we finna go get it because it's already got. So once you set your mind straight, now you set your actions. Actions come second. That's why they call it mindset. A lot of times y'all don't have problems, bro. Y'all just got fucked up mindsets. Because whatever your mind is set, the actions will follow. If you feel as though you can't do something, you halfway lost. That's why they say knowing is half the battle. G.I. Joe. What? That's what they mean by that. It's simple. Mindset. But anyway, y'all already know. I got love for y'all and how I feel about y'all. And sometimes I be doing these videos, I be like, God damn. We got to get it to go. So with that being said, man, I hope y'all have a blessed weekend. If it's, your, if it's your birthday, happy birthday. But most importantly, like I tell y'all all the time, man, in order for you to be found, you must first be lost. I'm out. Uh, uh, hold on, hold on.